Okay, sorry if that was like a weird cut. I literally just had to go to sleep because I'd been playing for so long. Um, <laughs> so anyway, I am back now. And uh, yeah, so what, what were we doing? I was kind of like in a exhausted... I was playing the game for like literally eight hours straight. I have no bloody idea who you might be, but I hope um, you're a Oh, what happened to you? When did he get his head messed up? Um... So anyway, yeah, we're gonna go talk to the king. Let me see what I can steal from him first. I still need to see if I can get my stuff back. I was thinking about that earlier. I was like, wait, did I lose everything? Come in, Witcher. I wish you to feel at ease as this is an unofficial audience. You help me in the mist, thus I surmise you do not seek my death. Which leads me to ask what you do seek here, Geralt of Rivia. I go over the top his like outfit is peace and quiet to clear my name yeah peace and quiet sire i need to clear my name though i tend not to meddle in politics this time i believe i have no choice hmm you must answer quickly and unequivocally you must be clear witcher i'm in no mood for excuses hiding behind professional codes and trade secrets did you kill Foltest? no do you know who did um, why would I say no? A witcher named Letho. Do you know each other? I don't know. I have amnesia. Letho has suggested he knows something about me. It's possible we met before. There's an old kid when he's saying, a bitch will never bite another bitch. A hundred percent accurate where sorceresses are concerned. To the matter at hand, sire. Tarnasaville claims this Letho is in the area. Is that true? Yes. What does he want here? My head? He's hiding from Yorvit and his Scoyatel. I don't know his plans. And you aim to get him? I do. Last question. Do you know who had Foltest and Demavent assassinated? Who's behind the Kingslayers? I don't know, but I'll find out when I find Letho. My spies have confirmed your words. I suppose I must believe you. Now to the other matter. The mist, the wraiths, all that magic shit holding up my campaign. My mages, as usual, have proved useless. They blather on about higher magic, delayed curses, and other hogwash. But nothing comes of it. This matter must be settled with a sword. A witcher's sword. Will you manage this task? Uh, yeah. Yeah. I'll manage. Excellent. Lift the curse, and you'll learn the meaning of royal generosity. And even should you fail to catch this letho, I shall help you clear your name. Consider Deathmold at your disposal. He'll give you all the necessary information. Also, you are free to move about the camp and its environs from now on. Now, leave me alone. Awesome. Um... What activated the curse? The curse was cast three years ago. Any sign it's been active in the interim? Is that important? Sire, we're not talking about a fortune told in a tent on market day, nor about some curse cast by a novice mage. This curse caused a solar eclipse and summoned hordes of specters. We're dealing with a complex spell that operates at several levels. Uncommon knowledge and skill were required to cast it. Lifting it will be even more difficult. If I'm going to deal with it, I need you to cooperate. Ah, the plague. So be it. Uh, what? As we forged our way through the fog, you claimed it was Glevisig's curse. Sabrina Glevisig's. She was a sorceress, my former advisor. I ordered her bound to a wagon wheel and burned alive. While dying, she cursed me and my lineage. That was three years ago. Why did they do that? What, yeah. What did you condemn Sabrina for, sire? One year after the Peace of Sintra, I fought Demervin for Lormark. General Vandergrift commanded a part of my force. He forded the Pontar and joined battle on this field. It raged until evening when Sabrina Glevesig decided to take matters into her own hands. Fireballs rained down onto the battlefield. Three thousand men turned to bloody charred meat scraps. The fire consumed Kedwenis and Adernians alike. Knights boiled alive in their armor. Mad beasts howling with pain. War is for the honorable. When the likes of Levisig enter the fray, it turns. 
into hell. That's weird. What drove Sabrina to attack her own army? Any specific reason? I've heard none, not even speculation. She was my advisor, a member of the Council of Mages. For years I was forced to tolerate her excesses, schemes, court scandals. Was she loyal? Ha! <laughs> Only to herself. Hmm. Sire, do you remember the curse itself? What exactly did Sabrina say? All she said at the time has been fulfilled to some degree. A star adorned with a bloody braid will cut across the heavens. Square coins from maritime depths will beguile the hearts of fools. Coins? Deathmold found a few such coins among soldiers accused of treason. Hmm. That's weird. Coins? I wonder what those are then. Well, interesting. Uh oh. Witcher, a word, if you will. Uh oh. Again, this guy. I don't trust this guy. Talk to Deathmold. What all is here? Is is this like everyone's quarters or whatever? I keep wondering if you can actually cook. I think that'd be funny. Um, wait. Let me just double check these. We checked this one already, right? Yes. Let me check. Don't catch on fire. Don't catch on fire. <laughs> I swear I do that all the time. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> I just walk, like, directly into the fire every time. I swear. I'm a stupid person. Um, okay. Where did he go? Oh, this must be his tent. Okay. Oh, wait. Let me steal all your stuff first, and I'll be right there. Just one second. One second. This is really important. I kind of hate that I didn't do all the side stuff. I kind of... I don't know. I'll, I kind of wish that I had done some, like, taking care of those nests and stuff, but I don't know. I was just kind of like, I was kind of ready to just go ahead and be done with it, you know? Like, to just kind of go ahead and move on. Look so, what the cat in. but I don't know. I have a problem I have with RPGs. Sometimes I rush through stuff. I'm like, I'm like, oh, all this stuff to do. Then I'm like, eh, I just want to do this, the main quest, which is good because it's you intriguing. You have no idea how delighted I am to work in tandem with you. True, I have no idea. <laughs> Better times approach, Geralt, you shall see. I trust you're not bothered if I refer to you by name. Not at all. Wonderful, I feel we shall become great friends. Hmm. I'm not looking for new friends, Deathmold. Let's get to work. I see. As you seem to be the hero, how might I help you, White Wolf? Not all were aggressive. Did you notice that not all the specters were aggressive? Most would disappear when we neared them. I think the curse's power corrupts the ghosts of those who died in the battle, turning them into draugers. Draugers? Is that some professional name you witches have for specters? They're demons, Deathmold. Draugers are demons of war that arise on battlefields where the fighting was vicious and the slaughter particularly bloody. They are hatred and bloodlust in condensed form. The name matters little. Do you know how to rid us of these draugers? A silver sword's enough to send them to their rest. But as long as the curse remains active, new ones will appear. The soldiers' ghosts are the key. If we could reverse the tide of the battle... Don't delay. Grab your sword and start reversing. I'll need some symbols of war that belonged to the soldiers who perished here. Artifacts symbolizing hatred, death, courage, and faith. They have to be magically active and linked to those who died. Without them, I won't be able to summon the ghosts. Well, I've no idea how to find them. Apart from which, I know little about war symbolism. I'll deal with the artifacts. I have another job for you. Have you dealt with curses before? I've cast a few in my time. One victim sprouted donkey's ears in a tail, another's house burned down. Nothing too serious. Shame. Have you removed curses, lifted spells? Never had the chance. But I mastered the theory involved. Best in my class at the Magic Academy. They don't teach you about curses like this one at Banard. Glevis's curse is a fourth level blood spell. It's also known as the Archmistress's curse. A misnomer, for they've been cast by generally crazed mages or priests, not necessarily women. You've done your homework. Uh... Explain this blood curse to me. An ordinary blood curse is a trivial thing. You let a little of your own blood. Best done at midnight, surrounded by lit candles. Sabrina had a whole pyre around her. Tell me about Glevisig's curse. Read about it for yourself. I have all the necessary literature. In fact... You only need the great encyclopedia of curses, spells, and prophecies, and a, a volume compiled by to side of reason Margarita Lohantil, Masters of Magic on Curses Selected Writings. Uh... 
quite a tome. Oh, okay. I don't know if we can actually read it. Um, oh yeah, what's with the coins? We've got our comet and murder. What about the coins? We have those as well. Not enough for you. No. Why do I get the feeling I've stumbled on some shameful secret? A state secret. If you don't tell me, your head of state may soon lose his head. There's a plot afoot within the military. Those involved share a symbol, a square coin adorned with a fish. Let's do this. I shall in no way hinder your investigation, and you will reveal to me anything you learn. Should I happen upon anything related to the curse? You'll let me know. So be it. Hmm. Interesting. Are you sure Sabrina cast the curse? Positively. Curses of this kind are cast rarely. There have only been six confirmed cases. How many confirmed cases of their being lifted? One. By a team of mages led by Archmistress Francesca Finderbear, whence came the curse's other appellation. In any case, Sabrina Glevesig was part of that team. Small world, and one that just got a little uglier. That's not all. The curse that Francesca and Sabrina dealt with was meant to end the lives of the last of the Tyson dynasty, the rulers of Covil. It was cast by Scarlet Rodelega, a very talented but completely mad man. A prophecy and an activator were also involved. I see. Sabrina just stole her curse from this Rodelega. Precisely. Beside which the king himself and a company of armed men witnessed her casting it. Hmm. Why is Henselt still breathing? He killed the priest. Why didn't he burst like a ripe tomato under a dwarf's heel? Perhaps Glevesig wishes Henselt to wait for imminent death. I don't think so. I know a few sorceresses. They're mean, true, but they also want results. Sabrina cast the curse while roasting at the stake. Not the most comfortable circumstances. I suspect she botched something. Are you suggesting Henselt may be safe? I'm suggesting he could be saved, provided we cut him off from the heart of the curse, the Battle of Spectres. It's the weakest link. How could we do that? I don't know yet, but I suspect I could summon Sabrina's ghost and force her to free Henselt. First, I need to learn the circumstances of her death. Hmm. If I'm not mistaken, you need blood to cast a blood curse. Precisely. Unachievable otherwise. Sabrina was bound to a wagon wheel. Where did she get enough blood? She put a spell on a soldier who gave her a coup de grace. It was easy. The minds of some soldiers are so uncomplicated. Sabrina needed one of them to strike her, shorten her suffering, but complete the curse. However, this is where she erred. That whore performed miracles, gathered the power, got the prophecy and activator right, but fell flat on her face on the simplest thing at the end. Don't get so excited. She chose a fool, a bungler. I heard he thrust five times with his spear. Yet the witch's soul would not quit her corpse. There was no one guarding the pyre? It was one of the guards the sorceress chose for the task. His comrades were irate. He spoiled the show for them. The king was no longer anywhere near. In any case, blood flowed and the curse took root. Yes, but the harlot got her due. Hmm. You're gonna help me, Deathmold. Of course, as the king ordered. Listen up. You'll do the paperwork. I get the feeling you like it. I'll need a number of protective rooms to summon Sabrina's ghost. They need to detain the sorceress's ghost and anything else that enters this world with it. Find something for me in your library. The runes need to be easy to produce. I haven't seen any artists around here. Apart from that, the Draugrs are likely to begin their forays in search of Henselt. When they leave the battlefield, they'll grow weaker. Your men should be able to handle them. Just equip them with silver-plated weapons. Henselt could also use something silver to defend himself. Over the entrance to his tent, hang a wreath of songfoil and fool's parsley. Inside, a fire fueled by juniper branches must burn at all times. Where will I get so much silver? Melt down your collection of pots for all I care. Just get it. Those aren't pots. They're silver vases of Nazaya. Last of all, give Henselt an instructional talk. Explain that I'll need him. And what will you be doing? Drinking ale and fondling the camp women? There's that, yes. <laughs> Though I'll also prepare to summon Sabrina's ghost and figure out what I need to send the fighting specters back to the afterlife. I'll drop by and give you more work as I learn about this curse. How did you divine that you might recover your memory by lifting the curse? Um... I don't like people poking around in my life. Learning about others is my job. I must know the secrets of all who wish to approach the king. I've no problem admitting I like the work. My past has nothing to do with Hensalt. You don't know that. Do you know why I have no friends, Witcher? Because sooner or later I learn all their secrets, which is followed by interrogations, torture, 
executions. Just leave my past alone. Dang. Uh, standard sword and armor. Huh. Okay. Search the side of the execution. Yeah, I kind of want to do that. Um. Piss off. You shut up. Uh, I was trying to camp about the symbol of courage. Okay. Talk to soldiers about the conspiracy against Henzel. All kinds of missions. Oh my gosh. Who's this guy? Is he... No, he's just chilling. I thought maybe he was a traitor or something because of the way he looked. Okay. Sup? Didn't know if he was someone. Is there any more loot? Yeah, this one's loot over here. I kind of want to go to the tavern or whatever, see if there is a place to store my items, see if that's there. I hope it is. I hope they wouldn't be like, oh yeah, by the way, it's just, you know, it's not here anymore. I like the mirror kind of works. That's cool. It's kind of like, I think from what I've heard, mirrors are like insanely hard to do in games. So it doesn't always work. I love that. Oh no. Gosh, I'm too fat. What do we pick up? Uh, Stennis' sword. What? Oh, that's like super powerful too. I wonder if it's like a, a big sword. How much are we? Oh gosh, we're like really overweight now. 19. Huh. Okay. This is the same exact thing I have. It's like I don't want to drop anything. Wait, is the rake that much? Why is the rake that heavy? Okay, drop the rake. And what else do we need to drop? Huh, what is this thing? Um, no, no, wait. What does it look like? Oh, wow, that's odd. It's <laughs> a very odd looking weapon. Um, let's see, let me go back to whatever I had. What did I have? I don't need a short sword. I don't need like a hundred of these things. And then, what the heck did I have? Equipped. I'll say I'll just go ahead and put that there and then oh I had the robust cutlass. That's what it was All right, then we'll go. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, that must be a heavy sword then All right, I need to go find a um, Like a tavern or something and then we'll continue on these missions Taverns over here, right? Was it this one on the behind me? What's this? These guys doing? Hmm. I'll talk to him in a second. Uh, no way, I bet it's over here. I couldn't. Re yeah, yeah, this must be it. It has the notice board outside. I couldn't remember where we were. Uh oh. What's Leave this? me be, father. Leave you be? Your life's at stake. <laughs> Why, your mother would have my head if anything happens to you. No. This is about my honor. And play what mother does to you. I'll practice. I must prepare. The heck is that? Speak to the soldier. Okay, one second. I, I got stuff to do. Going to the slaughter like a pig for uh, not I can do. Where's like the? Is there like a dude here or something? Uh, please tell me there's a storehouse or something somewhere. Who is the um? Take all. Relics, artifacts, trinkets, and talismans, hallowed and highly valuable. Uh, what? Got anything interesting there? Ash from the stake where Sabrina burned. Nails that fastened the wheel of death. Splinters from the wheel. I've also got some metal parts and some of the martyr's garments. Whatever your heart desires. Hmm. That stuff that we actually need sounds like some of that stuff may actually be important. Doesn't sound like we can actually buy it though. What, what chunk do I have? Sell that, and then what weapons were there? I don't need that. Maybe that. I'm not quite sure. Don't need all these short swords. And I'll have to check on those things. Did I check these? How many? Whoa! How many things do I have here? Holy crap! Going to the slaughter like a pig for a feast. I don't see the. The store house thing. Where do I store my stuff? I'm very scared. Oh no, I'm stuck. Um. Uh, no. I was hoping that was it. No. <laughs> oh no. 
I hope there's I a place. Myron, master Apothecary in King Hensel's service. Geralt. Geralt. Provenance and profession known only to him. So be it. How can I help you? I want to stock up on herbs and medicine. Got a prescription? A prescription? I jest. We have supply <laughs> shortages, so I can only sell you certain medicaments. Uh... And Godspeed. Good. good luck with whatever it is you do. Hmm. Uh, this could be bad. I don't see, like, a storehouse anywhere in... That's the inn? Oh gosh. Um Leave me be, Witcher. Shut up. Train. No time like we kinda need to have like a chest somewhere. <laughs> because I had like a thousand things. <laughs> Wait, who's this? Yeah? You're the quartermaster's assistant? Yeah. Great. I want to see the best equipment you have. I've got the coin. The army stands to gain, not lose by me. I should think so. So? <laughs> what? Craft me an item, let's trade this. Blah, 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 blah. Godspeed. Okay, I'll, say, I'll talk to you later, sir. I need. I'm on a mission. We need to see if there is a place to store my weapons. Let me. Or, uh, store my stuff, I mean. Let's just double check. Um, Surprised. What's in there? They have a hand in every I don't want to, like, pick up everything. Cars. If there's, you know like. Me, I'm not um, well, I don't you know, get if, it, if it's too heavy, we don't need picking it up. Um, okay, yeah, whatever, blah, blah, blah. We'll never understand them. Ugh. Shut up. Who is that? You really annoying. Oh, wow, look at all those swords. Look at that. Okay, I have to do that later. What's over here? What is that guy saying? Um, yeah, like I said, this may be kind of bad. Um, I guess we lost everything? Ooh, okay. Well, let me just look at my stuff real quick. We need, let's look at, um, can you see if something's like a heavy weapon or not? So we have this thing, 2025. So this is better. So we don't need that. And then I'll, I'll keep the cutlass. I'll keep Stannis' sword. We don't need the Aspidon or however you say that. Um, what am I missing? Oh yeah, I think the Andrega thing. Was there silver? Oh well, okay. Um, this is actually better than what we were wearing. Let's check the rest of the boots. Um, that's kind of the same thing. Okay. So all the boots, I think, are the same. What about this armor? What is this? Um, resistance to bleeding, poisoning. <sighs> Sign is different, but that has like other things. We don't need this. What about the pants? 668, 66. No, they're all 666. Oh my gosh. Oh, it's the same exact like, things. That's why it's the same. I see. <laughs> uh, we already did the boots. This is. Oh, that's weird. Reduction of damage, extends duration of oils. That's weird. We'll keep that. So I can sell all those things. Um... Oof. Man, this is bad. I don't know where to store my items. Uh, I may look it up just to see if it's possible. I'm done with this um, wait, what is okay? What is this guy's problem? He's shut up. What do you want? Um, I heard you calling out for Audrin. What of it? Just curious. Half the camp's looking for him. Well, he's gone and got lost. But Audrin's a good man. He can drink six noggins of liquor, one after the other. Wouldn't mind buying him a pint. What does he look like? <laughs> Ordinary, like any soldier, except he staggers a lot. Audrin! Hmm. Audrin other, other people are looking for him? Are you? Um, so where am Audrin, I? Where I'm gonna look this up real quick. So we're in the lower Kedwini camp. Okay, one second. Okay, I looked it up. There's actually something outside. This is how we go outside. Yeah, okay. Where is it? What is this? There's actually like a brothel or something outside. And then uh, if you go there, there's a... Um, there's like a place to store your items. Oh, oh is this that guy? Oi, Witcher! 
Out in these wastelands, hunting monsters? Well, if you see two of my men, tell them I'll rip them both brand new assholes if they miss muster. Um... Why did they go out there? What are they doing there? It's a common malady. A day don't go by that some dimwit don't sneak out of the camp to go to the gullies. Hmm. I'll look for him. We'll see if I come across anyone. Luck be with you. You're a good fellow. Ah, find them and you'll see Corporal Zivik knows how to be grateful. Okay. Cool. Thanks. Lost lands. Yesterday. That's funny. Uh, I'm not sure if this is it over here or what's that over there? I feel like it's this. Oh, wait. Is that it? Yes! Yes! Okay, cool. It kept everything I had. Awesome. Okay. That scared me. I was really afraid it wouldn't uh, keep everything. So that was that was bothering me. Okay, good. Now we can concentrate <laughs> on focus uh, and like focus on stuff. Uh, I don't think I need that. Um, and then I need to sell my clothes. Wow, I have so much weight. Oh, and that other sword. Okay. Hello, you fine people. Margaret. This is the brothel, apparently. Okay. Um, anything else in here? No. Who are these people? Hey! What are you guys doing here? Let me save it real quick. Greetings, Geralt, in these humble foreign walls. Greetings. My heart rejoiced to see that dear old noggin of yours emerge from a sea of unknown faces. Hmm. Uh, let's see. Uh... I see you prefer the company of Vernon and his men. The soldier in Hensel's camp looks at me like I'm a lump of rotten meat. Do you think they suspect you of being a spy? Who the fuck knows what's in their bloody heads? You know what? I regret I'm not a spy. I feel like the last bloody cunt here. Somewhere nearby, my brethren are sharpening their axes. Just waiting for the fog to dissipate so they can blunt them on some kid when he nets. Okay. <laughs> You've been around. Heard anything about the Kingslayer? Just that Henselt is shitting himself for fear that his head is about to be separated from his shoulders. For me, the assassin's hiding out in the ravines. An ideal place for his kind. Anyway, I've been wondering, why the fuck do you care so much about this cunt that you're so ready to stick your neck out to find him? Um, I have to clear my name. Because I'm innocent. The wise know that. And I didn't think you'd trouble yourself about what the fools think. As long as Letho is free, I'll remain a suspect. I can only prove my innocence by presenting the culprit. No other way. What will you do when you find him? Hmm, I'll probably kill him. A crime carries punishment, and there's only one punishment for murder. Um... All rested after the boat trip? Don't remind me of that. My stomach chums at the very thought. You could have traveled here on foot. If I'd known it before days of rocking, I would have. <laughs> and if they told me I'd be eating dried and salted cord three times a day, I'd have clobbered myself with my own hammer before boarding that boat. I like the way the clouds are. You see how the light is changing? That looks really good. You're spending all your time in Roach's camp. Have you two become chums? Chums? That's a bit rich. But he doesn't piss me off as much as he used to. Either he's changed or I've grown accustomed. Maybe both. Maybe. Besides, the camp has loads of other attractions. There's men cheat me at cards, and there's a tit or two to hang the gaze upon. If that's what you're after, there's a regular whorehouse in Hensel's camp. How can you compare a whore's tits to Vessie's? I could buy myself the others, but hers are just to be admired. <laughs> what? Okay, um, uh, let's see. What about Dandelion? I see you finally decided to relax. Have I ever told you I think you lead a very unhealthy life? You've mentioned it. Evidently not enough for you to take it to heart. Anyway, the whores are quite decent here. Maybe some other time. You worry me. <laughs> um, let's see. Oh, gosh. My memories and feelings seem inextricably linked. I seem to be recovering both. I believe Yennefer's alive, and I'll eventually find her. Triss? Yennefer? That's some life you lead, my friend. First off, we have no idea if Yennefer's still alive. Second, we have no idea if Triss is alive. Hmm, true. 
You seem to have two women, when in fact, you don't even have one. Their kind doesn't die easily. I'll find Triss as soon as I've dealt with the assassin. What about Yennefer? I won't know what to do about her until I see her. Hmm. I wonder if we will encounter Yennefer. Hensel's camp is abuzz with rumors about the events three years ago. When you burn a sorceress at the stake, rumors spread faster than the seed of a lascivious baron. I know you primarily value sorceresses for their firm busts, but I'm curious. What do you think of Sabrina Glevisig? Sorceresses complain about feeling underappreciated, persecuted even. But let me tell you, Geralt, you live by the sword, you die by the sword. If they didn't meddle, they wouldn't be burned at the stake. They keep whining about the horrors that took place on Thanet Island, about the order of the world being destroyed. But let me ask you, who brought that about if not them and their scheming? Hmm. Heard anything about Letho? They say he's hiding in the ravines. He's not alone. I know. I fail to comprehend exactly why you have it in for him. He escaped, so what? You're no king, and as such, are hardly in danger. Uh, same thing. I'm tired of having to explain that I'm not the Kingslayer. Hansel believed you. But he's still not sure, and I don't want him doing me any favors. Let's say you catch him. What then? First we'll have a talk, then he'll pay for his crime. Punishments vary. But there's only one punishment for murder. Uh... Have you tried to, uh, approach this? <laughs> I've thought about it. On the one hand, I've never rogered a soldier, but on the other, the clean clang of steel against steel at an intimate moment could put off even the most attentive lover. Why do you ask? i just like to know. And then... I wonder what Sheila's doing in Hensalt's camp. You're not alone, because she's wondering what you're doing at the king's side. How do you know? She asked me about you. What did she want to know? I have no idea. I realized right off she was sniffing. I told her she could smell my fingers if she wanted. But that'd be all she'd get. And she gave up. Mm-hmm. See how careful I am? <laughs> I'm proud of you, Danny Lane. Alright, who else is here? Just random people. Pretty, please. Greetings, I want to stock up on provisions. Seek and ye shall find. Uh oh. The prophet. They're stuck. He was a shepherd, had experience in seeking and finding. The good book. That's what we of please. Any discount on account of that? No. Uh the prophet Lebiota encourages the giving of discounts. <laughs> I, I don't recall that this. Oral tradition. Hmm. And if your neighbor offers you a basket of apples for a ram, say you shall take but half a basket, for ten more neighbors will come. And five of them will offer you two baskets of apples for the ram so many covet. An endless source of wisdom. Browse and choose. <laughs> okay, so we have storage, uh, and then... Oh my gosh. Okay, everyone is like... Scaring me. I'm gonna get out of the way. We're looking here, right? Yeah. Hey, watch it. What is this? Hi. Well, well, a witcher. Girls, prim yourselves. How can I help you, handsome? Um. I wanted to talk. We're no strangers to the art of conversation, but it'll cost you just as much as a good plow. Uh, no way. I'm not gonna pay for conversation. They like, do I need to like talk to her for some reason? I don't know. Sunny Maybe I'll save it. The <laughs> <laughs> it's orders it's like my mother. <laughs> what the heck? Oh wait, here's the thing. Uh, no, just random stuff. Let me save it and oh shoot, is that her? Oh, that's yeah, someone no, else. Let me save it real quick and then we'll see what happens. Well, how could? Um, talk to me. I wanna We're uh, Sounds all right. Ask away then. What would you like to talk about? Um. Wait, what? Anything interesting going on in the camp? Soldiers are scared shitless. What with this battle approaching, they'd rather drink themselves silly than let us honest whores make some coin. Is that interesting? I doubt it. Not raring to fight, are they? They might have been eager at first, but the longer we sit here, the less lively they become. Fighting's like plowing. Lust for one, and you lust for the other. Does that cost something? 
Okay, I don't know. I don't think there's any point in that. Um, let's see, let's go over here. What's, who's this? What's this? Uh, take care of yourself. What is this place? That place is like a mailbox. You see that on the map? Old Town Cellar. Hmm. I wonder if that's going to be a quest or something. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. What was that? He looked scared and I heard his sword. Oh my gosh. Is he attacking me? What? What's he doing? Oh. There's a thing over here. Oh, Rock Fiend. That was, um, that's one of the quests that we got. Let's kill these things. No, this is scary. I'd hate to, like, be right here. Oh my gosh. Whoa. They blow up. Whoa. There's a war going on over here. Okay, watch out. I guess he's gonna blow up again. Dang. Okay. Are these... Are these all soldiers with the same side? Couldn't tell. Wow. Okay, that was weird. They just like came running out of the tent. Oh shoot, look at this one. Dang. Watch out, fellas. Okay. There we go. I'm gonna watch out. Is that all of them? Okay. Are these the soldiers she was looking for? What's up? <laughs> oh, there's more. Dang. Wait. Oh, that must be the soldier that everyone's like. No. They got him. Good job. Good job. Okay. What is this? I can't, like, interact with it for some reason. Huh. I don't know. Let me let me walk over here and, like, walk back to it. Maybe that'll help. Hello? Why can't I do anything? It's acting like there's still something over here. Maybe that's what. Wait, I can get that, though. I don't know. It's weird. I don't know. I feel like maybe it's because there's still enemies or something. Oops, someone's behind me. No, see, I don't think that he actually is. <laughs> oh, shoot, I got poisoned up. Okay. Anyone else? I don't think so. Alright. That's so strange. Huh. Okay. Well, what you think down here? So this must be kind of like the outskirts, kind of like in uh, where we just were. Rock something. I can never remember what that place was called. Wait, who's that? What happened to him? What's up? Um, can I look at this now? What can I look at this? I want to look at this thing! Wait, get it. Come on. There's a thing trying to murder us, Geralt. <laughs> we need to hurry. Oh, shoot. Okay. I wonder if that will actually hurt me. Why is it? Do I need my cat potion or something? Let me save it real quick. I wonder if that's what it is. See how it has an eye? Drink. Cat. Drink. Let's just see what happens. I feel like this is kind of a dumb idea. But I was thinking maybe we're supposed to like follow the blood trail or something, you know? Um, kind of like with that other one. Uh, I don't think so. What was that? There we go. Some loot. I don't know. What does it say? Uh, promise uh, keep an eye out for this and grunts. I assume this is them, but I don't know. Let me just load the other save so we don't have to run around with a stupid vision the whole time. Ugh, man. Yeah, I don't know. That's weird. I'm not quite sure why I can't actually interact with these guys. Hmm. I don't know. It's like freaking out for some reason or something. I'm not sure. Anyway, we'll go back into um, the town. I feel like I feel like I don't really need to go out like on an excursion. I feel like I'm kind of uh, getting carried away. I'm kind of I'm kind of getting that sense. Like I'm trying not to fall into it, but I feel like I'm kind of getting that sense of like overwhelmment from the camp because there's so many. It looks like a face. There's, there's just like so many people to talk to and so many things like that. And I'm kind of like, I'm getting that feeling of like, oh gosh, like there's, you know, there's people here and there's people here and there's this story and these people. And I'm kind of like 
my eyes are starting to glaze over a little bit, you know, because I'm just like, there are so many people. Like, this is kind of stressful. So I'm trying not to, uh, I'm trying not to, you know, feel like that because it's like, you know, it doesn't need to be like a stressful thing. I'm just kind of, I, something about it makes me feel that way though because it's just like, there's so many people to talk to. Okay, so this is where Roach and them are. Okay. Watch out for He's down Watch out for him. Oh, wait, what was that? Okay. What? Greetings, <laughs> Geralt. Greetings, Vess. What news from the Blue Stripes? They're keeping their eyes open, as always. Um. Hensel thinks he'll take Vergen easily. A regular army will always win against a popular uprising. I know this, Hensel knows it. I don't understand why Saskia doesn't. Maybe she'd rather die than surrender. Or she has a surprise in store for Hensel. Possibly. Hensel keeps the precise plans of his campaign a secret. Why haven't you set up in the Kidwenny camp? Information becomes more available the closer you get to the source. Hensel doesn't trust us and I don't blame him. If not for this damn fog, we'd have moved even further south. Hmm. We've lost the Assassin's trail. The trail led us here. If it goes no further, the Assassins must be in the vicinity. I see two possibilities. Either Hensort hired them, or he's their next target. We'll find out soon enough. Hmm. Could Henselt himself be behind the assassinations? You don't think it's possible? Consider the Pomtar Valley. Temeria, Kedwin, and Edern have been disputing it for generations. Only now, Temeria and Edern are kingless. True. Henselt might profit from the deaths of Foltest and Demavent, but covert assassinations aren't in style. I suppose you're right. The Kedweni king seems to love a good war. Just take a look around. Perhaps that's his ruse. When the cheese goes missing from the larder, no one thinks of blaming the cat. Hmm. Interesting. He's standing with his back I like this a lot. His She's really cool. He spreads his cheeks um, so you get this. I can see that. <laughs> the heck are they Not talking about? I'm gonna grab all the crap and then I'll talk to you, Roach. Don't worry. I want this other thing. And those swords. Yeah, I haven't looked at that one yet. Oh yeah, we still have tons of loot to get back in the camp. I, I didn't pick up everything because I was like, I can't. I don't have enough storage. Um, lots of stuff in here. Oh shoot. Grab that and that. Grab this and this. And did we ever craft that? Um, did we ever craft that armor? I don't think we did, did we? There's still some armor that we did in the um, Kairin armor. I don't think we ever crafted that. Um, how did I get over? Get out of the way, Roach! But we'll have um, to do with them. We'll put them ah, I can't get to it. Here to spy on us. Who would I be spying for? For Henselt, the Death Mold. I heard they hired you. It just so happens we have common aims. But don't worry, observing Vernon Roach isn't one of them. In that case, to what do I owe this pleasure? Oh gosh, that's a lot of talking. Um. I was wondering what you're actually doing here, Vernon. The blue stripes never want for work, especially in a combat like this. You're not about to tell me, are you? And here I thought we had something special. <laughs> I've got my finger on the pulse, and I've not forgotten what I came here for, Geralt. Fortest assassin. Precisely. He's holed up like a rat, and he'll meet a rat's end. Any idea what's happening on the other side of the Battle of Spectres? Well, I expect not much has changed. A bunch of dwarves, elves, and peasants are trying to figure out how to save Edern. Saskia is an exceptional woman. But just a woman, nonetheless. Besides, how would you know? Just a hunch, and there's all the talk. Besides, to assemble an army of elves, dwarves, and humans who fight side by side, you pretty much have to be extraordinary. You'll not persuade me some woman will defeat Henselt in battle. You're forgetting one thing. Kedwin's just fighting for a better life. Edern's fighting for life itself. Motivation's important, I grant you. But it can't trump knowledge of the art of war. Temeria's my only concern. And I'll be glad to see Hensold's forces tied up here. That's a good thing. Think he wouldn't stop after conquering Edern? What if he quickly deals with Saskia and turns his army west? It's possible. But I hope it won't come to that. Hmm. You need to be careful. Death Mold can't learn that you're holding a Kedweni spy. He won't. Don't you worry, none. Death Mold has an excellent net of his own spies. That spy we caught at Laredo's, Arnold. He's prancing around in the next world. 
Uh, what? Why did you kill him? What else was I to do? On the boat, you said he was living proof of Henselt's conspiracy against Tamaria. I didn't plan it. He just didn't survive the interrogation. <laughs> Maybe you shouldn't have keelhauled him. If you'd been cooperative, I wouldn't have had to. Did he spill anything interesting? He was tough, but waterboarding can be incredibly effective. Eventually, he coughed up that Henselt was trying to bring the border towns to a boil. Henselt's not stupid. He wouldn't want to wage war on two fronts. That Rattlerito was supposed to stir unrest in Flotsam. Luckily, you rearranged his intestines with your blade. You miss your old friend, Jorvith? If the gods are kind, he'll yet fall into my hands. That said, I wonder what the scoundrel's up to. Um, about Flotsam. What news of good old Flotsam? Thanks to us, it still is good old Temerian Flotsam. If I hadn't sniffed out Lorido's treachery, a Kedweni garrison would be stationed there already. Constable John Natalis has appointed a new commandant to Flotsam. Let's hope he doesn't turn out to be another whore. Hmm. Cool. <laughs> Good to see you, old friend. <laughs> Terrible losses um, on the let's left see if anyone else they is in almost here. Broke our... Hello? Okay. Oh, What's up, guys? Uh, you guys talk a lot. You need to shut up. <laughs> You're distracting me. Fen! Keep dropping your guard like that and they'll beat your kisser to a pulp! Who do we have here? Someone who's worried about your close combat skills. We practice a few hours every day. And here I thought practice makes perfect. Really? Care to show us your skill then? White haired one. Uh, sure. Why not? Who's willing? I'll try. See if you're as strong in your arms as you are in your gob. Let's, Let's see do what it. my friend Vernon taught you. Make some room! Close the distance! I thought we were all pals. I got the tattoo and everything. Uh, uh. Okay, I got this. Uh, uh, okay. No, you leave me alone. <laughs> what was the. What was the arm wrestle, dude? We'll have to find him, too. Okay, come on. Oh, see ya. <laughs> Dang. Nice. Who's next? Got a feeling Fen won't remember much of that fight. With a few more surprises up our sleeves. How about you? Uh, what? Why not? Who's willing? Take me on. I fancy learning a few witches' tricks. Let's see what my friend Vernon taught you. Make some room. Move it. Okay. Dodge. Dodge. I don't Break know if there's up. really, if this is considered like a mission. I'm just kind of like punching these guys. For no reason. We'll see what happens after this. If there's like someone else, we will fight the third guy. Cause that's kind of how it's been, right? You, there's usually like three guys to fight. Close the distance. Uh, uh. Okay. Oh my gosh. Nice. <laughs> awesome. Go get her up. Go get her up. He's still young. He'll learn. With a few more surprises up our sleeves. How about you? Um, sure. Why not? Who's willing? Run out of monsters to slay. Why are you fighting my men? Just checking to see if you've taught them well. And? I'm amazed they're still standing. You lackeys. Letting yourselves get thrown around like hay bales. Maybe you want to give me a try. Oh. Show me what you got, my striped friend. Oh my gosh. It's gonna be scary. Oh. Hey, Roach. You suck. Take out our frustrations on him here. <laughs> Poor Roach. He's an interesting character, but he is a bit brutal, though. That's probably his biggest problem. I mean, killing that prisoner, I mean, that's not good at all, obviously. Ooh. Oh, nice. Dang. That's intense. You win. Feels like I've been kicked by a mare. Pleasure getting a few slugs in the mug from you, Witcher. We're always eager to learn. You deserve a prize. I don't need a reward. It's no reward, just a sign of gratitude. We drag our asses round the world and collect all sorts of scrap metal. Take something, 
May it serve you well. See you soon. Not so fast, Witcher. Huh? You'll take me on now. Oh. You snitch. Hmm? You snitch? What? So be it. Who's this? Uh, 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 I press the wrong button. Uh, okay. I was like, the uh, the quest thing was distracting me. I was like, wait, what are we doing? And then I completely messed it up. And get started off on like a A or something too, which is kind of a little bit different. Usually it's like W or D. W. Okay. Quick time events are not my speciality. Who is this guy? He's from the other camp, right? He's not a blue star. Nice. Oh, did I hurt you? What, you what the bloody hell's all this about? Hey, it's you. We're just practicing. Want practice? I'll have you cleaning the canteen with your bare asses. How's that for practice? <laughs> Back to the camp. I sir. That doesn't end this. Stop looking for square coins. You blit it again. And you just might lose your head off. Ooh. So long. Interesting. Yeah. So he doesn't like for us to uh to do that. Wait for events to unfold. Hmm. She comes up to him and Interesting. Sultan, why are you doing here? Are you allowed here? <laughs> He's like a freaking like traitor. Alright, so we've checked here and here. Um I guess we'll go back into the place. What was the quest for um this? Learn more about them. Okay, we have been killing them, so I won't worry about that too much right now. Um Wow, oh, we have so many things here. Defeat Can I find this guy, by the way? Do I have like a quest? What was his name? Uh Defeat Adam Bartholomew Bar yeah. Himself okay, so his name's Adam something. I assume he's over there. By the way, did I sell that sword I was going to sell? Oh yeah, what was this one? Ten fourteen. That's not that good. So I'll sell the Espadon and that sword. The sword which won't be named. Um wait, there's two vendors? Where's the second one? This guy? Greetings. Welcome an opportunity when it comes. They say you run a traveling pawn shop. Where do you even have books? No song, no supper. Nobody mentioned you speak in proverbs. A willful man <laughs> must have his way. Ah, he still speaks in the phones. How long do you have to go on like this? Lost time is never again found. Uh, what if you lose the bet? What happens if you lose the bet? Crows do not pick crows' eyes. Good luck anyway. Fortune is easily found, but hard to keep. I wish you persistence then. Can I see your goods? I'm mainly interested in those books. Better to ask the way than to go astray. <laughs> oh, we can change your hairstyle. What books does he have though? Or what does he have in general? Diamond dust, all that kind of stuff again. I don't really need any of that. Initiates the Order of the Flaming Rose. Ah. That's um, that was from the first game, the Order of the Flaming Rose. Harpies, how to kill Bulvor, Monstrum, or Betrayal of Witchers. Huh. I w don't know if I should. Um. It's like, some of these, like, I feel like I may find some of these books, you know? Rot Fiends, how much is that? Why don't we just go and buy the Rot Fiends book? Maybe that'll help us learn more about them. Maybe I should just start spending my money more freely. I feel like I don't do that. Um, I don't need that. And then... Yeah. Okay. Oh yeah, we don't need any of these, right? Uh, no. Okay. Awesome. Wow, we got a bunch of money for that. Let me save it. I want to get a different, uh, haircut. Let's see. Oh my gosh. So what do we have? We have... Full ponytail. Let's do shave temples and a ponytail. Let's see what that looks like. I'd like to eventually try all the haircuts. Oh, this is what we had to start with? Um, I don't know. This looks pretty cool, though. I like that. 
I like this little shaved look. I'm a huge fan of that kind of like shaved sides and stuff, you know? I think that looks really dope. Um, okay. I don't think there's really anything else here. Look how cool that looks. That's awesome. We'll have to go back out. Oh yeah, let me read that book on the uh, rock fiends. Maybe it'll help me to kind of learn more about them. Given that they are necrophages, rock fiends feed on carrion and human corpses, but this does not mean they do not attack the living. They appear on battlefields near cities afflicted by plague or around villages touched by famine. If you rock fiend, you can be sure that there are many more in the area. They appear of a sudden uh, and disappear even more quickly if threatened, so exterminating them is difficult. Trapping them makes little or no sense. Instead, they're best dealt with by cutting off their food supply, burning all corpses in the area. Corpses must be incinerated rather than buried, or four rock fiends are avid and skillful, skillful diggers. Without sustenance, the beasts will leave in search of new feeding grounds burn all the corpses around the camp oh so that's why we had um that's probably why there were those uh corpses with the eyeball thing so we're supposed to burn them maybe that's maybe that's the difference yeah that one looks like it is burned though interesting so maybe we're supposed to use the um igni sign i wonder if that's like a thing I wonder if, like, I know I keep saying that, but I wonder if that will hurt me. If they blow up on me. I don't know. Okay, so if I look at you. Search. Oh, look, there we go. Okay, so you just left click it and burn it. That's why it was, like, doing that. Okay, that's cool. Maybe that's... Maybe that was the thing why I couldn't blow up those nests. Maybe I just didn't know how to do that or something. Because he was just like, gotta blow up the nests. I don't know. I probably should have just looked it up. This looks really cool, by the way. I like this. Um, but anyway, let's go ahead and go back into the town. Um, well, why don't we go burn those other corpses real quick since we know where those are. We may encounter them again, but just since we know that they're over there, let me go ahead and do that. What is that? Oof. That looks cool. This is actually a really cool area. I was afraid it would it would just kind of feel like more of the same. But actually, I like the enemies. Oh, that was weird. That apple just went flying. Um, I like the way the enemies look and everything. It's just, it's pretty sweet. These rock fiends are cool. These, uh, I like this whole kind of like faction thing going on here. Die, foul beast. Um, I wonder if I mark that, if I have that mission active. I wonder if that will um, show me where the bodies are. Where is it? This. Um, because I would like to do some of these other missions, because, like I said, I feel like I didn't do a good job with completing the other ones. Burn it! Where's that? Um, yeah, there it is. Necrophage oil. Sweet. Um, let's see if we can help them with these guys. There we go. And I burn you. Nope. Put that up. Put it away, Geralt. <laughs> I don't know if there's a button for just like holstering your weapon. I'm not sure if there is. I have no bloody idea who Ooh, you might they're about be, to but die. Smell Isn't there another body over here somewhere? Hello? I wonder when the mission will end. I thought there was another body, but I can't remember now. Hmm. But yeah, like if it's like burn all the bodies. Like I wonder if there's like an easy way to find them. Again, maybe the using cat or something like that would help me. Cause then you could kind of just see the body like sitting out in the open somewhere oh look six of nine and maybe it's just as you come across them like they'll maybe these will like respond kind of like mmo style or something uh i'm just gonna look around the area real quick though because there may be more just like right here um let's see this is really cool i like this whole like little babbling brook here it's pretty cool um anything in here Oof, I just want to go exploring. This is really cool. We'll hold off on it though. Like I said, I, I want to, um, I do want to go and just finish, you know, talking to everybody and getting all that kind of squared away in town. Um, I didn't know if that was something. Look at this place. Oh wow, look at that. There's like, whoa, there's like this whole other area. Oh, look at all that out there. Dang. That's not the enemy, is it? Is there, is there two, like, factions that are against each other here? I couldn't tell. Ah, I didn't know if I'd go there. That'd be kind of interesting. Yeah, I don't think there's anything over here. Maybe, I did loop around somewhere, so maybe that went somewhere, but I'm not gonna worry about it. This is cool. I like this. <laughs> it's a really cool looking area. 
I love the lighting and everything here. It's just really cool looking. Oof, the sun setting? Seems like it's getting kind of dark now. I don't know. Hmm. But yeah, if we... I'm kind of thinking, like... I know it's kind of leaning more towards Triss, but like... I feel like if we have the option to romance Vess, I'll probably take it. I feel like... I don't know. I, I like Vess a lot. I think she's really cool. Oh, hi puppy. Um, but yeah, who should we talk to first? I don't know. I still want to find that dude. Uh, what was his name? Like, Adam or something like that? I still want to find that dude to see if we can arm wrestle him. It kind of sucks that I didn't do that. the rest of those, like, poker missions and stuff. But, I don't know. It was, um, I wasn't, or dice. It's not poker. I just wasn't a huge fan of that, though. The way it plays is kind of confusing. What do you want? Normally, I only talk to drunks. Um. Let me buy you a beer. <laughs> All right. What do you want to talk about? Let's see. What do you know about the Virgin of Edern? No one's plowed her. I'm serious. They say she'd killed a dragon. Those Edernians have gone silly about her. I heard the story about the dragon is true. What of it? That don't mean she should be crowned queen. True, but people follow her. Folks are fools and like freaky things. Saskia's a freak. Maidenhood intact and hunting dragons. Ever heard of a stranger, lass? Still mm. looking for coins. So that's the uh, house service under Henselt. See anybody complaining? And we don't like busybodies. Mm. Okay. All right. Oh, oh look. loot! All kinds of loot! Oh my gosh! What do you want? Oh shoot! Normally, um, in that case, go away. Around. I may talk to him about something. What else am I to do? Huh? Why are they talking about coins? Hi. Let's see if anything's over here, real quick. I don't think so. Where did, um, did we talk to, um, the female sorceress? I can never remember her name for some reason. Um, did we ever talk to her again? I don't remember if we actually did. I don't think we did. Wait, how heavy am I now? Oh, we're good, okay. I got you have to say that. How heavy am I? <laughs> it's such a weird thing. Whoa, this is a weird thing to have to, like, figure out. Oh, what's this? Uh-oh. Piss off out of here. You're talking to an elder. So show a little respect. You prick liquor. Respect for you? This is no place for crappers like you. <laughs> Out, I said. Aye, true. Join the pigs in the pen. That's your place. Oh, my. Should we intervene? Oh, okay. Well, it's already been happened. You, all right? <laughs> you best leave. Old Maverick ain't a good companion. Oh. Unless you're looking for someone to mock. What I saw back there, that happen often? What's the problem? I've bigger problems to deal with than the camp tramps. My nightmares have invaded my waking life. The specters haunt and hunt me by day. Come on. Nightmares are common. Start at the beginning. One night, I walked to the riverside and sat there. Staring at the stars, I must have fallen asleep. I dreamt of my birdie, her milk-white bosom, her gentle voice. I saw and heard her as if she sat beside me. And then that voice became a terrifying whisper. Curdled the blood in my veins. I opened my eyes, but the specter remained. It went on talking, hovering over me. Stretching its mitts out towards me. I felt a deathly chill, and then it happened. What? Never been a coward. At the fore and fierce in many battles. But a human's one thing. A specter's another. No other way to put this. I shit myself. Out of fear. Pants right full by the time I got back to camp. Since then, they mock me. Call me the crapper. <laughs> I 
I didn't see anyone mocking you. Well, except for those two drunks. Then you haven't looked around well enough. I'm the laughing stock of the entire camp. <laughs> oh, sorry. That just sounds funny. Um. Yeah, why did you go? Why did you go to the beach? During Hensel's last expedition, we stayed in a house there. My unit was on the lookout for Demavan's forces trying to cross the river. I just wanted to recall the old times. So you took part in the campaign three years ago? Took part? I barely escaped with my life. Leva, the brothel medic, saved me. Talk to her if you want to learn more. She knows everything about the camp. Hmm. What time did the Spectre appear? I went to the beach after my watch, so it must have been an hour before midnight. Oh, where's he going? I've no idea how long I slept, but when I reached the camp, it was dawning in the east. Hmm. I'll deal with the Spectre, but you should know a Witcher's services don't come cheap. My soldier's pay is meager. Got but a few coins in my pouch and some pipeweed. Will you do it for that? Uh, yeah. All right. Fine. He spoiled the hut on the cliff in the Riverside Beach at night. Leva. Who's Leva? Was there? Is there another brothel? I'm kind of confused. Is there a? Is there a brothel here and then the brothel outside as well? What was that one called? Let's see if it says Leva. Maybe it'll give me like a uh, Leva. I don't know if it'll tell me where she is. Oh my gosh, little sisters. No, it's okay. It's just someone over there. Okay, I was just kind of confused on that. Okay, well we'll have to do that. Anyone else over here? Uh, no. Oh. What is it? Uh. I heard there are some lovely ladies around here. <laughs> Only heard the same. Only heard. Left me fiancé at home. Gave me word I'd be true. <laughs> That's cute. He's a good man. What do you want? Uh, I heard that Sabrina Glevisig was burned at the stake somewhere nearby. Upon a hill. Four congregate there to this day. What for? They say it brings luck, but I don't buy that superstitious shite. Hmm. Okay. What you want? Uh... What? I think I'm being followed. Very likely. Who is it, and why? Death Mold's men. They're everywhere. Word is they're onto some plot, but that's all I know. Our hair looks so cool. I like that. Okay, cool. Um, I should probably. Oh. I, we met in Vizina. I was working for Salamandra and barely escaped your mm. rat. Grown wiser since. Listen, I've a trinket. My last reminder of those days. Take it and hold no grudge against me. I hold no grudge, and I'll gladly accept the trinket. Take it, and good luck. Interesting. Okay. That's interesting. I wonder if he actually is someone. I assume it's probably not, but either way. Um, we'll have to talk to this guy, see if we can set up a fight or something, can we? Yeah, okay, one second. 